I want to tell you about a new feature that's available in NX version 8.11. It's local caching of builder command outputs inspired by Bazel's caching mechanism. Bazel also coordinates a distributed build system, which is why we're working hard to add full Bazel support to NX. But you can use local caching of builder command outputs right now. Now a builder command is anything you can run with NX run, and that can be build, or lint, or test. And what NX will do is the first time you run this command, it will cache that output, both the file output and the console output. And then future times if you run this command and nothing has changed in your file system, then NX will just pull from that cache without actually executing this command again. Let me show you how to set that up. You go to the NX.json file and add a tasks runner options property with a default and set the runner narwhal workspace tasks runner version 2 and then supply some options the cacheable operations key here is where you tell nx which commands you want to be cached now with this configuration in place, anytime NX runs a build, a test, or a lint command, it will try to cache that output. Let's try this out. So if I run NX run my app test, the first time I run it, it will actually execute all the tests. And that took three seconds. Now if I run the exact same command again without changing any code, it was almost instantaneous. Let me do the same thing with build. The first time, it's going to take a few seconds to actually run through and build this application. And that took about 20 seconds to build. Now I run the exact same command again without changing any of the code. And it's instantaneous. I can even see in the disk folder, here's the output of the build. I can delete this, run this again, and the disk folder is back in place. Now if I go in and I actually change some of these files here, and I add a little message here to the index of HTML. Now if I run the build again, the cache has been invalidated and it will actually rebuild everything again. All of the caching that I've shown you so far has been stored locally on the developer's machine specifically in node modules dot cache nx. We've been internally testing a distributed caching setup that will work even if your local cache has been removed and your disk folder is removed by downloading a cache from a centralized location. Now I've gone off camera and switched this workspace to using a distributed caching mode. So imagine I'm a different developer that just checked out this branch. I can run nx build my app dash dash prod. And since this is already set up in the distributed cache, it happens almost instantly. 